Hello, my name is Jay Wilson. I'm the mill manager here at International Papers Savannah Mill. This mill began operation way back in 1936. This mill produces over a million tons a year of liner board. Liner board is the raw material that goes into making corrugated packaging, cardboard boxes. We make these tons here and we ship them all around the world. We utilize the port of Savannah next door to export more than half of what we produce here at the Savannah Mill. We have over 600 dedicated teammates here at the mill to help us make our product 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, 365 days a year. The safety of our teammates is our top priority. It's really more than that, it's a core value. It's what we think about every day when we come to work, making sure everyone goes home safely every day. Lots of opportunities for careers here at the Savannah Mill. We have folks that operate clamp trucks, engineers, finance folks, communications folks, electricians, lots of different opportunities. I think you're really going to find it fascinating to learn a little bit more about how wood fiber turns into liner board and finally a cardboard box. I hope you enjoy what you're about to see and learn more about the Savannah Mill. Welcome to International Paper Savannah, Georgia Container Board Mill, where safety of our team members is our number one priority. We hope you'll enjoy learning about our facility as well as the paper making process. Hey folks, my name's Tommy Ward. I'm an employee here at the International Paper Savannah Mill. I work in the fibers department. I'm currently the wood yard training coordinator. First and foremost, safety is our number one priority here at the Savannah Mill. We want all our employees to go home the same way they came. We don't want anybody to get hurt. The majority of our wood comes in here as pine longwood. So what that is basically is we, the trees are cut down on the woods and delimbed, and then they're loaded onto a tractor trailer and then transported to us. So once he puts that load up on that loading deck, of course he's got to hoist that load about 54 feet in the air and set it on a loading deck where there's some pin stops up there that'll cradle that load until the control room operator is ready to drop the load into the drum. The role of the barking drum is to strip those trees of all the bark because bark does not make good paper. So after it rolls through this the barking drum, it comes out of the other end of that drum with the majority of the bark knocked off of it. And within a short distance of about 25 feet, that whole tree feeds directly horizontally straight into a chipper. We convey or transport those chips up to the pulping part of the department, the pulp mill. That's where those chips are mixed with chemicals and steam in order to cook them over an eight hour process continuously so that once they come out of the bottom of that digester, they're now pulp. They're now ready to be refined, washed, and sent to finished products to make paper. Hi, I'm Nick Hewitt here at the Savannah Mill. I work in the fibers department. So I'll start by saying our top priority here is safety. On the pulp mill half, where we try to get all the wood chips that we receive from the wood yard and we cook them in two large continuous digesters that are basically two large pressure cookers that receive the wood chips, heat, and chemicals to try to create a prime pulp for the paper machines to turn into paper. Hi, I'm Corinne Enriquez and I work in the utilities department at our International Paper Savannah Mill. Um, at the IP Savannah Mill and across our company, safety is our number one priority. We want to make sure that everyone gets home at the end of the day. In the utilities department, our role is to provide both steam and power to the entire mill, as well as maintain the liquor cycle. Now you may ask, what is liquor? So we have three different types of liquor in our craft process. We have white liquor, black liquor, and green liquor. Our white liquor is produced in our recost area and is used as a cooking chemical for our digesters to make pulp that goes in our paper machines. Our black liquor is a byproduct of our craft process and then is burned in the recovery boiler and recycling process to produce steam that eventually gets converted to power. Um, the green liquor is a byproduct of burning that black liquor and then gets reprocessed in our recost area into white liquor. For the power side, we produce about 1.5 million pounds per hour of steam that gets run through both of our turbines in our power boiler 
and produces 84 megawatts of power on average. At the Savannah Mill, our recovery boiler is actually one of the tallest buildings in Savannah and is one of the best running boilers in IP. We also have our number seven lime kiln, which is actually the most efficiently run kiln in the IP fleet. Hi, my name is Albert Jones. I'm the area manager for maintenance at International Paper Savannah Mill. Safety is number one priority at the Savannah Mill. Each morning we start our morning off with a safety meeting. It is very important that we start our day thinking about safety here at the Savannah Mill. In maintenance, we are responsible for ensuring the operational effectiveness and the runnability of the equipment in the, in the mill. Uh, reliability is one of our big uh, goals that we go after. We focus a lot on preventive maintenance. Uh, we do a lot of uh, PMCIs to make sure that our equipment is in top shape and try to, to uh, prevent uh, failures happening before they start. Hi, I'm Dennis Sapier and I work in finished products. Here at the Savannah Mill, safety is our top priority. Our people are our best asset and we want to keep them safe no matter what. Here in finished products, we take pulp and we convert it into finished liner board. The liner board is then cut to a specific roll size for our customer. The Savannah Mill makes about 3,000 tons a day. 69% um, of our product is exported to foreign markets. And uh, here at Savannah, we make enough paper in one day to pave a four lane highway to Green Bay, Wisconsin and back. Uh, safety is the priority here at Savannah Mill. Environmental stewardship is our second priority, and then our third priority is making quality products. <laughs>